the ratio of ages of a and b 4 years ago was 4 is to 5 8 years from now the ratio of ages of a and b will be 11 is to 13 what is the sum of their present ages so 4 years ago ratio of ages of a and b was 4 is to 5 that means 4 years ago their sum was divisible by 4 plus 5 9 here the options are present ages sum of the present ages of a and b so 4 years ago sum we have to subtract 8 years from present sum this is present sum sum of ages of a and b so we have to subtract 4 plus 4 8 years from the present sum then you will get the 4 years ago sum of a and b then that will be divisible by 9 so 76 minus 8 is equal to 68 that is no divisible by 9 so option a eliminated 96 minus 8 is equal to 88 that is no divisible by 9 so option b eliminated 80 minus 8 is equal to 72 72 is divisible by 9 so option c is the answer here if you check 72 minus 8 is equal to 64 that is no divisible by 9 so option d also eliminated either you can follow the option method that is very simple you can find the answer within two seconds so option c is your answer if you want to find the answer in normal method four years ago four years ago the sum uh, ratio of ages of a and b was four is to five after eight years ratio ratio is 11 is to 30 so the difference between both these are 12 years 8 plus 4 12 years but you can see the vertical difference between 4 and 11 and 5 and 13 is not same so to make it equal take the horizontal difference that is 2 and multiply it with 4 is to 5 take the horizontal difference of 4 is to 5 that is 1 and multiply it with 11 is to 13 so that means 4 into 2 8 5 into 2 10 here 11 is to 13 into 1 11 is to 13 now you can see the difference between 8 and 11 and 10 and 13 is same that is 3 unit 3 unit is equal to 12 12 years that is 1 unit is equal to 4 years so your answer will be 4 years ago the ages will be 4 years ago the ages will be 8 into 4 and 10 into 4 that is 32 and 40. Now after 4 years that will be 36 and 44. That is sum will be 80. So your answer is option C.